streets never worry about nothing We just living our life and we giving now blessings This is CMRLA This is CMRLA Time now, Night of Champions, Ozone, turn up! Yeah! I'm your host, RC Sniper, one shot. Yeah. I got my co-host with me, two major. Ah. Set Gang South, we out here, setgang.com, check it out. Uh, we hope y'all ready for this next battle. On this side, we got Spider Murphy. Woo! And on the left, we got Basic. Mr. Basic, 757, shouts out to Orlando, 407. We're going to Wall Street after this. Right. Spider Murphy, you came the furthest, call in there. I'll be there. Damn. All right, the magic moment. Heads. Hold it down. All right, basic, I'm about to get really racist. <laughs> Within your heart is a beige chick controlling your life with a little joystick reading code off the matrix. <laughs> Talking about, I'm gonna convince the world I'm so light-skinned that everyone just sees in night vision. You are so light-skinned, you had a nice Christmas. You got some white mittens and your dad took you ice fishing. <laughs> You are so black, you be smoking the kush, yet so white, you still voted for Bush. <laughs> you are so white, you have three TVs, but so black, you're still on EBT. <laughs> you are so white, you don't say ass, you say keister. On electric guitar, you can play Weezer, and every time you sit in the hot jacuzzi, you make creamer. <laughs> this out, yo. Listen here, nitwit. You got to quit wit, but I think faster. I got the ability to think backwards. I think after, I'm going to go to Danielle's house and bitch slap her, and if you got a problem with that, she can judge whose dick's fatter. Whoever wins gets fucking jerked off with a little mango-flavored cherry lip smacker. It's insane you'd be a Ving Rhames anal rim smasher. Only if you were King James, you'd be a Kim Basic or kidnapper. And your mother looks like Mick Jagger. <laughs> Nigga, your mother looks like Michael Douglas had liposuction, only she had her lipo tucked in her flat ass, so now it looks like a ripe old pumpkin. <laughs> and she gives brains under the I-4 junction and a little tattoo that reads psycho something. <laughs> One more? All right, check this out. Basic, you couldn't walk a fucking mile in my A6 because you're a fucking beige bitch. Nine. Tom, Tom. Give it up for Spider Murphy. Round one. All right, round one on basic. Not a champion. Talk to him. I says yo. Yo. I says real rap raw. Fifty six off the cuff. Come here, little nigga. Peep this pimp shit. I says sixteen bitches in my bed. Yeah, and two in the kitchen. What that? Nigga, that's 18 bitches. Anyways, despite popular belief, I'm not Asian, by the way. Just saying. But in 1735, 100,000 people died in a Beijing earthquake. And guess what, you dumb fuck? November 30th, 1835? That's motherfucking Mark Twain's birthday. Facts. Real facts. All right, OK. I'm about to turn up in this bitch. Jay! I got that John Jacob Jingleheimer Smith, nigga. <laughs> His name was my name, too. And if you're standing there confused, trying to figure out what I'm about to do, I'm about to show you how fucking easy it is to come up with some multisyllabic frivolous bullshit about nothing that has nothing to do with nothing but uttering complete fucking nonsense that's mad off topic. And that's why it's so hard for me to rhyme in these battles. But for the rest of my round, it's about to be so easy to sound like you. I says, yeah. <laughs> I bet this past Thanksgiving you Mags and James took turns baits in a turd ducking with your little fucking customizable ass seen on TV, Ed, Ed, and Eddie, OMG. Easy bake ovens, what you fucking <laughs> It's a little fucking 
fucking gluten-free hummus and your individually packaged prune and plum sugar-free corn muffins with your fucking <laughs> confetti and coke like cocaine selectively sprinkled throughout your whole fucking turducken oven stuffing. And see, that's when the flavor ran past spiders by cuspids. Then he looked at James Roy like this with his hands on his hips all bewildered and disgusted like, oh my God, James. Did you put sugar in this recipe? Like, actual sugar in my magical mystery muffin menagerie recipe? <laughs> what? Spider's like, come on guys, you know how those non-saturated dairy fats make my face look bad, and all that weight just goes straight to my thighs. Yeah! <laughs> 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 in Ferguson or the one who got shot in Ferguson. One minute you're talking about, well, why would cops murder him? The next minute you're fucking watching Fox News soaking and sopping all the nonsense words to him, talking about Eric Gardner was a caring father. I can't make the call. Next week you got a t-shirt that says, breathe easy, stay alive, don't break the law. Nigga, I will really fucking, I will fucking break your jaw. You see this fucking sweater? If I take this off, I'm gonna turn into sideshow raper Bob and Danielle's the first one getting raped and killed like Darth Vader's mom. Cause it's time. Then you hear the Vader song, I fucking deliver a Vader bomb on tater tots and hit you with the plate it was catered on. Not before I look around and tell your mom in the way to carry on, grab the waiter's tong, smash over the head, take a shot of fucking Jaeger bomb, a little maker's mark, and I'm jerking off sniffing your mom's favorite thongs. Check this out, dog. You and fucking Johnny Voss are the biggest friend zone ambassadors the world's ever seen. Have you ever seen Danielle's Evergreen? I have. It smelled like feta cheese. It was never clean. I said, have you ever seen Danielle's Evergreen? It smells like feta cheese. It was never clean. It would bleed, then excrete extra epinephrine creams. She got me fucking, she got me fucking high like I was on methamphetamine. She was born with somehow Keith Jardine's defective genetic genes. Yes. Yes. Nigga, you fucking, you have no breath control. You need to hop on Deca, Trembolone, Lexapro, eat a couple of breakfast pimento loaves, and maybe you can fucking stretch and extend your flow. <laughs> send you back to fucking wherever go. You fucking little Chino Latino, fucking where were you born in Mexico? You are so light skinned you make Ahmet Dida look like a white Christian. On basic, Night of Champions, talk to him. Bitch, you make me nauseous. You look like fucking Polly Shore had sex with Polly from Jersey Shore and out came this fucking Italian Bruno Mars that had sex with Ricky Martin. That's a quadruple entendre. You reek of insecurities and you're well into your 30s. Spider Murphy, you're just way too old currently to be rapping like this and acting this immaturely. Spider Murphy, listen to me. Who the fuck is 33 with proactive red radish acne cheeks with those fucking stage three seal and type acne scars? Could you fucking Pickly pink pimples that you squeeze too hard. I said, the side of your face is the same texture and color as another butter. The thing a cop scrub could do to this man's face is a motherfucker. Bitch, I'm a motherfucker. I'll fuck your mother, then kill that motherfucker. No sentiment. Before I body bag that bitch, I hand a body bag over to him and make Danny Glover. I really hate when I hear Wigger say nigga. Wigger? Please tell me the allure what makes you think it sounds cool to say nigga. I mean, I'm half black. I don't even say it like that. I mean, I said it 18 times when I rap, but none of those times, none of these cats' lives gave a fuck about that. I just snuck in a double meaning punchline in there. Spy, did you catch that? Spy, dare, did you catch that? You're from fucking Palm Beach in Holiday City, where the sun is shining and everything apparently is pink and pretty, and the only crime they got going on in that city is pedophiles and sex offending, and yeah, you fit in. Not to mention, they got flamingos out that bitch. And because he feeds them on this burning speed box by the fishes, he thinks he's the fucking king of them shits. <laughs> Side note, you inbox my homegirl Danielle 447 times on Facebook with no reply in a row. <laughs> you, wanna, you wanna date with a Spider Murphy? I'll ask it for you, bro. Hey, Danny, will you go on a date with Spider Murphy? Hell fucking no. Yeah! Well, bitch, now you know. You need to let it go, let it go. Oh, now your mouth is frozen. And just in case to you that it didn't concur, no girl named Danny is gonna date a dude named Danny because no girl is gonna date a fucking dude with the same fucking name as her. Facts. I'm not trying to put you on blast or even teach you a lesson, but nigga, you said you'd eat her ass. 
Yes, you did. You said you'd eat her ass, you tongue fuck her butt, you put her little baby nose in the crack. Bruh, your breath stinks like Kevin Gates. I seen the text messages. Oh. <laughs> Dog, I carry that steel like goodwill. Hunting spider, that 3 8 of deuce tray, you have your bitch ass. Running spider, that 12 gauge, you have your bitch ass. Jumping spider, cause my gat got ratnophobia. Cause I don't fuck with spiders. <laughs> monetizing everything I do. I'm about my business, you heard, but that's still better than what you do for a living, Spider Murphy. You're a personal weight trainer at Curves. Come on, Spider, don't act like this. You know, you, you know you're a personal weight trainer at Curves and you love that shit. And with your job, you were able to save to get your 03 Mercedes in like two summers, dreaming about custom peak floor mats and suede flamingo seat covers. With your own little baby parallel parking system and your fucking flamingo roadside assistance number. And guess what? This Mercedes can swerve clean in between two baby H3 Hummers because they don't get no dents or nothing because it comes equipped with two customizable, custom interchangeable fucking red rubber side runners and two rubber baby buggy buffers. <laughs> Look like Howie Mandel. <laughs> I fucked her. She came and yelled. Yo, check this out. Yo, dog. This is how it would normally go. I would normally put you in dirt or rocking a pink shirt, but I think first I'm gonna insert my dick in your bitch first, deep within her stinker, getting tickled by her pink fur, cause she's a ginger. Shit keeps me warm in winter. Check this out. Johnny Voss is fat, but his dick is really the size of a splinter, and only the first inch works. And RC Mike usually wears. Little fucking King Tut Pharaoh King shirts. Where's Craig Lamar? He says he's a rapper, but he's really a singer. And you, you still a fucking BDM pinger? You searching for guys to fucking insert their dicks deep in your fucking sphincter? So check this out, man. You little fucking dog. You are so fucking white. And you fucking eat egg salad sandwiches. <laughs> fucking, I don't even know where I'm going with this, yo. <laughs> yo. <laughs> Nigga, you are so fucking white. You go to the club and order Grey Goose, yet so black you mix it with grape juice. <laughs> You're so white you came from a... Your great-grandfather's name was Sir Walter... Elton, and your favorite, so black, your favorite food is watermelons. <laughs> I'll freestyle it, yo. Yo, check this out. Yo, uh, friend zone ambassadors, back to that. These guys are the two biggest friend zones. They got, they've been wanting to fuck Danielle for years. But she realized that him and Johnny Voss are queers, so now she's feel comfortable around them and she lets them, I don't know. Give it up for Spider-Man. Next round, we got him. Yeah, yeah, go. Yeah, yeah. Next round, yeah, basic, yeah, round three, not a champion. Talk to him. I said, you must like Grind Time's new ranking system. Well, I don't give a fuck. Ills is cool, but I don't know how he comes up with this stuff. You're ranked 11 and I'm 32, and so what? Because as you see, I'm still battling you. So my rank must be, I can pretty much do whatever the fuck I want. You just did. 500 measly views on the Silver Channel with two major. I just did over 5K with Spider J, a no-namer. Bitch, right now I'm doing you the favor. Don't you hear what I said? I said I put Prime Craig Lamar and D-Rock on the main channel, and now they got me putting spiders back on the web. It's like, damn. Oh. That was only because... They said, they said, be nice, base. I said, it's cool. Hey, we street like ST, but around my way, we keep that Kanye. When I clap you, <laughs> when I clap you, I'm gonna have your brain spinning with your hands up. Your brain spinning with your hands up when I clap, clap like Beyonce. If we have a confrontation after this Sunday, I'm gonna plot on you Monday. Monday, grab the tool aid, put the metal to his face like Doomsday, and have your soul going up. Oh, no, too, no. You know, I feel like I already won this battle. Fuck this battle. In fact, 
for the next eight bars, I just want to talk about how June, summer, this third is past. I met, greeted, and seen in person Vita Guerra's ass. No, like real shit, Spider Murphy, like beyond this battle rap. Like, I know you're a man like me and you can appreciate a nice ass. I mean, it took everything in me just to say, Vita, you bad. But in the back of my mind, I was like, how do you get the job where you get the oil up that ass? <laughs> Besides all that, she was a really nice chick. And when she stood up and that butt brushed across my face, I man, ever since that day, I haven't been able to shave since. I mean, to be honest, Spider Murphy, you're really not that bad. If you ever come to VA or Tampa, you're cool, just don't bring mags. Matter of fact, if you come, just don't come acting like that unless you want the boys out gay to take this orange suit as a fag. You got the swag. You got the swag of like, if I came to your crib unannounced, I might stumble in and see two dudes kissing. Or something random like him and Getcha chilling in the kitchen while Getcha's mom in there with him and Getcha staring at the ceiling talking about Linda, Linda, honey, listen. Listen. You want to hear my bars again, Linda? You want to hear my bars again? That part about Getcha made me laugh for a bit. But you need to tighten up. I'm still bad on you. You don't get to laugh at my shit. I smoke super funky big L's to come up with this wild style. I got a funky fly rhythm and I've always been a wild child. I got reverses, rebuttals, and I can freestyle. And my guns go boom, boom, and your guns go pow, pow. <laughs> Fucking Danny Flores got the name Spider Murphy from a band that prayed in the Elvis Presley song. No significance to him. You just really like Elvis Presley, y'all. I mean, I'm right, Elvis Presley. Correct me if I'm wrong. Love him, my idol. See, that's how I know you a bitch. Cause you named yourself after nothing but a hound dog, you bitch. Thanks. Oh. 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 There we go, make some noise, y'all. Oh. Make some noise.